Morning everybody, here we are again. Uh, we're still up in Scotland in Dumfries. It's another gorgeous day, the sun is shining, uh, blue skies, birds are singing, yada yada yada. Um, plan for today. Are you laughing at me? Yeah. Thought you were. Um, the plan for today, we um, are going to first of all go round and just finish off the last of the little rust spots. There's really not an awful lot left, so we're going to get all those um, back down to the bare metal and get them acid treatment and uh, primed. And then we're going to go back around uh, all the priming that we've already done and just fill in some of the, the some of the gaps, just thicken the primer up a bit. And then we're actually going to hopefully start uh, flattening out the paintwork ready for painting the next time that we're up. So it's going to be pretty, quite a busy day really. Um, it's about 10 o'clock in the morning so we're hoping to get a good a good few hours at it. So Andy's just getting himself ready. He's uh, looking manly. That's what you're looking for. Manly. Yeah. Okay then. So uh, yeah, it's we had a really really good day out her yesterday, um, and hoping to have another really good day out her today. So there we go. Here we go again. Yay! So, uh, we're, Andy's just getting ready for the final bits. We stripped the back of the van yesterday of lights and bumpers and all that stuff. So we're just going to do the same on the sides, get the headlights off, get the front bumper off, um, all the bits and bobs that need to be out of the road. Um, just so that we can finish off grinding. Do that again. Wow. I'm not going to say it, but he looks like he's crapped himself, but there we go. <laughs> We're also going to hopefully, there's the inside, we've done the floor um, with the, the primer and that, but there's a couple of little bits on the inside, just on the panels. I don't know if you can see that. Um, there's like little rust drips, shall we say, coming down the side. So we're going to get them sorted out today as well. Um, that's our solar panel that we managed to pick up for 90 quid, 220 watts, so that'll be going on the next time. Um, and that's part from Maisie's rear end. Um, that's really about it. That's, there's not an awful lot else to say at the moment. It's not as windy today as it was yesterday, so hopefully uh, it'll be a little bit easier to work on her. But She's very spotty, very spotty. That's us. All done. Look at that beautiful blue sky. Cherry blossom. Lovely. And here comes the cat. Hopefully mouseless. Yes. Extreme close up. Uh. <laughs> yeah, quite. Right, yo, I'm going to bugger off now and uh, get to work. See you in a bit. So just to show you, that's Vera, uh, completely naked. She's had her bumpers off, all her headlights, side lights, all the side lights down the side of the van. Um, you can see actually that apart she. From one. Oh, apart from one. Yeah, there's being a bit of an object. All right, okay. How are we going to get that out then? Oh, I'll drill it out. Okay. Um, you can see actually that she hasn't always been baby blue. She has been, in fact, white. But she's staying baby blue because we quite like her. So, uh, yeah, just thought we would update you with uh, what she's looking like at the moment. Andy's butt. Again.
we have a compressor and a DA sander, so we're now just starting to sand down the roof, ready for painting. Uh, sand is doing the roof and then uh, I'll be starting to attack the side, so it's all go. Okay, just to quickly fill you in, I did see uh, what we were doing over the um, earlier on over the roof but uh, the sound of the sander might not have come through okay so I just thought I would show you this little beastie here which is a DA sander which is attached to a hose which goes all the way into the shed to the compressor so this is what we're using we're really really lucky actually because my um my brother and my dad have all this kind of equipment in the shed which is why we are up in, in Scotland with her rather than doing it all down in Portsmouth where we live. So we're getting the, the bodywork done up here where we've got the tools and everything to be able to do it properly. Um, so yeah, very handy. We have one of these beasties and an endless supply of, uh, I think they're 320 grade uh, sanding discs. Uh, I think we're going to go through a fair few of them because she's not a small van. Um, but yeah, we're just going to get her... Uh, get her sanded back ready to, to paint her. to the end of our second day uh, we've had we've done loads today we went round and did another second coat of the primer and we also started to flatten her back to um, just a matte finish so that she's ready for painting uh, the next time we're up so I'll just show you what she looks like now we're getting on for about half seven I think Quarter to eight, there we go. Um, so we've had a long day, we've been here since, been at her since about half nine, ten o'clock. Uh, but we're getting hungry, so it's time to go and get fed, I think. So I'll just show you what she looks like now. So, there you are. You can see that there's now some sort of dark blue and white marks on her, so that's where we've been uh, taking the top coat of paint off, just so she's nice and smooth and ready for sanding. We did use the DA sander with the compressor. Uh, I won't actually touch that because it's still wet with some top-up primer. Um, we actually only managed to get the back uh, of this panel done um, and the roof. So we've got a lot of work to do the next time we're up as well as getting her painted. But she's done for now. Um, and hopefully between now and the next time we're up, my brother's going to have a bit of a play with her and get some filler into some of the the dinks and things and try and make her look a bit prettier before we actually attack with the paint. And there is the man himself. Are you pleased? No. Because we haven't finished. Yeah. And we're still here. Aye. And we're not away enough. Aye. Snap. And I've just realised I've filmed all this with war paint on. <laughs> Oh well. You can't take the freedom. <laughs> Never mind. So there we go. So that's the end of uh, this episode, and we'll see you next time. Bye bye.